Hello students, today we are going to solve more examples on areas of combination of plane figures. Okay, so first example is four equal circles are described about the four corners of a square. So ABC is a square and these four circles are described on four corners of a square so that each touches two of the other as shown in figure. Find the area of shared region. Okay. And side of the square is given 14 centimeter. Okay, so if side of the square is 14, clearly this radius of each circle is a 7 centimeter. Okay, so R is equal to 7 centimeter. So how we will get area of shaded region? Area of shaded region that is area of square minus area of four quadrants. These are quadrants because each angle is a 90 degree. So area of square minus area of four quadrants, we will get area of shaded region. Okay. So we can write directly area of shaded region is equal to area of square minus area of four quadrants. Okay. So first area of square is side square. So here side is 14. So 14 square minus area of 4 quadrant. That is 4 into area of 1 quadrant is 1 by 4 pi r square. Okay. So pi is 22 by 7 and r that is 7 square. Okay. So this 4 and this 4 cancel. 14 square is 196 minus 22 by 7 into 7 into 7. So this 7 and 7 cancel. 196 minus 154. Okay, so if you subtract this 6 minus 4 is 2. 9 minus 5, 4. 42 centimeter square. This is the area of shaded region. Okay, so we will get this region area of square minus area of 4 quadrants. Okay, so we will get area of shaded region is equal to. 42 centimeter square. Okay. Now we will take next example. Okay. Second example is find to the three places of a decimal, the radius of circle, whose area is the sum of the areas of two triangles, whose sides are 35, 53, 66 and 33, 56, 65, measured in centimeters. Okay. Use pi 22 by 7. So here, what is given? We have to find the radius of circle whose area is the sum of the areas of two triangles having sides 35, 53, 66 and 33, 56 and 65. Okay. So two triangles are scalar triangles. So we have to find the area of these two scalar triangles by using Heron's formula. Okay. So first for first triangle A that is the side of triangle A is equal to, we have to suppose that 35 centimeter, B 53 centimeter and C is equal to 66 centimeter. Okay. So S is equal to A plus B plus C upon 2. That is the same perimeter. So 35 plus 53 plus 66 upon 2. That is if we add this 5 plus 3, 8, 8 plus 6, 14. 1, 6 plus 1, 7 plus 5, 12 plus 3, 15. So 154 by 2, that is 2, 7, 0, 14. 15 minus 14, 1, 14, 2, 7, 0. So 77 centimeter, that is a semi perimeter. So area of triangle 1, we have to denote it as like this way. That is, a, we know that formula, Heron's formula, S, S minus A, S minus B and S minus C. Okay. So S is 77 then 77 minus 35 into 77 minus 53 and 77 minus 66. Okay. So this is 77 7 minus 5 2 7 minus 3 4 this 7 minus 3, 4, 7 minus 5, 2 and this is 
11 ok so if we find square root of this 11 into 7 then this 7 into 6 and here 6 into 4 ok so if we take square root of this and this 11 as it is ok so 11 2 times take outside the square root 7 2 times and 6 2 times and square root of 4 is 2 ok so if we simplify this 11 into 7 77 and 77 into 12 that is 12 7 the 84 4 8 12 7 the 84 plus 8 that is a 92 so 924 centimeter square that is the area of first triangle ok similarly we will find area of second triangle so for second triangle A is equal to 33 centimeter, B is equal to 56 centimeter, C is equal to 65 centimeter. Okay, so S is equal to A plus B plus C upon 2. So 33 plus 56 plus 65 upon 2. That is 3 plus 6, 9 plus 5, 14. 1, 6 plus 1, 7 plus 5, 12 plus 3. 154 by 2 that is 77 again so area of triangle 2 that is area of second triangle again same formula s s minus a s minus b s minus c so 77 77 minus 33 77 minus 56 and 77 minus 65 Okay, so if we simplify this 77, this 7 minus 3, 4, 4, then 121, and this is 7 minus 5, 2, 7 minus 6, 1, 12. Okay, so if we find square root of this 77, 11 into 7, 11 into 4, then 7, 3, 0, and this is. 4 3 zero. ok so 11 2 times take outside the square root 7 2 times then 3 2 times and 4 2 times ok so 11 7 is 77 into 12 so 12 7 is 12 7 is 84 8 ok here I will check again 11 into 7 is 77 7 3 0 and 4 3 0 okay. 11 2 time 7 2 time 3 2 time and then 4 2 time ok so here we will get 77 into 12 that is a again here same that is a 924 centimeter square ok now what is given area of circle that is equal to sum of the areas of two triangles ok so area of circle that is if we suppose that having radius is r so pi r square is equal to area of triangle 1 plus area of triangle 2 so 924 plus 924 that is 4 plus 4 8 2 plus 2 4 9 plus 9 18 so pi r square is equal to 1848 so 22 by 7 into r square is equal to 1848 so r square is equal to 1848 into 7 upon 22 ok so here 2 11s are 2 9s are 18 2 2s are 4 2 4s are 8 again it divisible by 924 is divisible by 11 so 11 8s are 88 4 in 11 4s are so 84 into 7 so r is equal to square root of 84 into 7 so if you simplify this 7 into 12 into 7 so 7 take outside then 12 so 7 into 4 3s are so it is 2 root 3 so answer is 14 
root 3. Now we have to find answer in up to 3 decimal places. So find the value of root 3, or sorry, put the value of root 3 here and then multiply it by 14. We will get answer. Okay. So it is r is equal to 14 root 3 centimeters. Okay. Understand this one. Now we will take third example. Next example is find the area of the shaded region in the figure. Okay, so there are three semicircles. First semicircle having radius is 14 cm and these two semicircles are there having radius is 7 cm. Okay. And shaded region, whole region is a shaded region. Okay. So we have to find the area of shaded region. So area of shaded region is equal to area of this first semicircle, big semicircle having radius is 14 and plus 2 into area of semicircle having radius is 7 cm. Okay. So if we give here name, suppose this is A, B, this point is C. Okay. So area of shaded region is equal to area of semicircle. Having diameter is having diameter is AB plus area of two semicircle semicircles having diameter is BC. Okay, so area of semicircle that is half into pi into diameter AB means 14 centimeter plus 14 that is 28. So radius is 14. So 14 square plus means area of this semicircle plus 2 into half into pi into r square. So this semicircle having radius is 7 cm. Okay, diameter is 14, so radius is 7. So 7 square. So if we take half pi common, so what is remain? Pi by 2 in bracket 14 square, that is 196 plus half and pi common, so what is remain? 2 into 49. So 1 by 2 into 22 by 7 into 196 plus 2 into 14 and that is a 98 so half into 22 by 7 into 6 plus 8 14 1 9 plus 9 18 plus 1 19 plus 1 that is a 2 so here 7 4 is a 28 1 remain 14, 7 2s are and 2 11s are. So what is remain? 11 into 42. So if we simplify this, 11 2s are 22, 2, 11 4s are 44 plus 2, 46. So area of shaded region that is equal to 462 centimeter square. Okay. Now we will take fourth example. Okay. Fourth example is in an equilateral triangle. Of side 24 centimeter, a circle is inscribed touching its sides. Find the area of the remaining portion of the triangle. Okay, so equilateral triangle in that circle is there touching its sides like this way. Okay, and what is V1? Side of equilateral triangle is given. So ABC is an equilateral triangle. Side of this equilateral triangle is given 24 centimeter. Okay. We have to find the area of the remaining portion of the triangle. Means this portion. Okay. So how we will get this area? That is area of triangle minus area of circle. Okay. So for that we have to find first area of radius of circle. Okay. Now if we join this or if we draw this AD and this is center of circle. Okay. So here it is a perpendicular because 
BC is tangent and OD is radius. Okay, so AD is perpendicular on BC. So if AD is perpendicular, then in equilateral triangle, altitude and median both are coincide. So AD is median also, means it bisect BC also. Okay, so BD is equal to 12 centimeter. Similarly, BC also 12 centimeter. Okay. Now, here O is the in center of a circle. Okay. So, in equilateral triangle, in center and centroid both are coincide. So, O is the centroid of this triangle. Okay. So, here first we write O is the or here first write AD is perpendicular to BC therefore AD bisects BC so BD is equal to BC is equal to half of BC that is half of 24 that is equal to 12 centimeter okay then O is the centroid of triangle ABC okay because ABC is an triangle ABC is an equilateral triangle okay so in center and centroid both are coincide at point okay and we know that centroid divide medial AD is medial okay so centroid divide medial in the ratio 2 is to 1 Okay. So we can write OD is equal to this OD is equal to AD by 3. Okay. Because this is 2 part, this is 1 part. So total AD is 3 part. So we can write OD is equal to AD by 3. Okay. Now, now we have to find first AD by using Pythagoras theorem. Okay. So in triangle ADB AB square is equal to AD square plus BD square. Okay. Now AB square is 24 square is equal to AD square plus BD is 12 square. Okay. So 24 square is 576 is equal to AD square plus 12 square is 144. So AD square is equal to 576 minus 144 that is 6 minus 4 2 7 minus 4 3 and 5 minus 1 4 so AD square is equal to 432 ok so if you factorize this 432 we will get 2 2 0 4 2 1 0 2 3 minus 2 1 12 2 6 0 then again 2 that is 2 1 0 2 this is 0 8 then 2 5 0 2 4 0 then 27 then 3 9 0 ok so this one we can write AD square is equal to 2 raised to 4 or 2 square into this 2 square into 3 square into 3 ok so AD is equal to square root of this Okay, so it is equal to this two we can take common. Sorry, outside the square root, this two, this three, and this three remain square root. So two twos are four, threes are twelve. So twelve root three. So it is equal to twelve root three centimeter. Okay. Now we have to find OD. So OD is equal to AD by three. So OD is equal to twelve root three upon three. That is OD is equal to 3 4 are 12, so 4 root 3 centimeter. Okay, so now we will get OD. So this OD means radius of circle. Okay, now we have to find area of this remaining portion of triangle. Okay, so area of triangle minus area of circle. Okay, so here I am writing this area of remaining portion of triangle ABC is equal to 
एरिया ऑफ ट्रायंगल ए बी सी माइनस एरिया ऑफ सर्कल ओके सो एरिया ऑफ ट्रायंगल दैट इज रूट थ्री बाय फोर इन टू साइड स्क्वायर साइड इज ट्वेंटी फोर सो ट्वेंटी फोर स्क्वायर माइनस फाइव आर स्क्वायर नो आर इज ओडी सो ओडी फोर रूट थ्री ब्रैकेट स्क्वायर सो इफ यू सिंपलीफाई दिस रूट थ्री बाय फोर ट्वेंटी फोर इनटू ट्वेंटी फोर माइनस ट्वेंटी टू बाय सेवन एंड फोर रूट थ्री स्क्वायर इज फोर स्क्वायर सिक्सटीन रूट थ्री स्क्वायर इज थ्री सो सिक्सटीन थ्री इज अर फोर्टी एट सो फोर सिक्स अर ट्वेंटी फोर सो वॉट इज रिमेन ट्वेंटी फोर इंटू सिक्स सिक्स फोर जर ट्वेंटी फोर टू सिक्स टू जर ट्वेल्व प्लस टू फोर्टीन वन फोर्टी फोर रूट थ्री माइनस ट्वेंटी टू इंटू फोर्टी एट अपॉन सेवन ओके सो वैल्यू ऑफ रूट थ्री इज इवन वन पॉइंट सेवन थ्री टू सो वन वन फोर्टी फोर इंटू वन पॉइंट सेवन थ्री टू माइनस ट्वेंटी टू इंटू फोर्टी एट अपॉन सेवन ओके सो फर्स्ट सिंप्लीफाइव दिस ट्वेंटी टू इंटू फोर्टी एट अपॉन सेवन एंड देन फाइंड दिस मल्टीप्लीकेशन एंड सब फैक्ट ओके विल गेट एरिया ऑफ रिमेनिंग पोर्शन ऑफ ट्राइंगल ए बी सी ओके सो इफ इक्वेट ट्राइंगल इज गिवन इन सेंटर एंड सेंट्रोइ बोथ आर गो इन साइड सो हियर ओडी इज इक्वल टू ए डी बाई थ्री बिकॉज वी नो दैट सेंट्रोइ डिवाइड्स मेडियन इन द रेशो टू इज टू वन ओके सो यूज दिस एंड फाइंड ओडी ओके आफ्टर दैट एरिया ऑफ रिमेनिंग क्वेश्चन दैट इज एरिया ऑफ ट्राइंगल माइनस एरिया ऑफ सेल्ट ओके सो नाउ वी विल टेक नेक्स्ट एग्जाम the fifth example is an athletic track 14 meter wide consists of two straight sections 120 meter long so this is two straight sections having length is 120 meter okay long joining semicircular ends so these two semicircular ends are there whose inner radius is 35 suppose this is o and here o dash we can suppose that this is 35 cm given inner radius Okay, calculate the area of shaded region. Okay, so shaded region is given this track. Total track is given shaded. Okay, so this is shaded region. Okay, now how we will how we will get this area of track? So area of track that is now if you observe this, these two are rectangles. So A B C D. Here I gave names. That is A B C D. These two are rectangles. Okay, and uh, wide uh, track. The width of track is given fourteen meter. Okay, so this is fourteen meter given. Okay, so here these two rectangles are there A B C D having length is one twenty meter, breadth is fourteen meter. Here again same. This is length is one twenty meter, and width is fourteen meter. Okay. so we have to find the area of track in that two rectangles consist okay having length 120 and breadth is 14 meter okay now what is area remain that is a uh, this area okay area of this semi circular ring this is a ring so see here if you observe this this inner radius is 35 and width of track is 14 meter so if we add this you will get outer radius okay and if you observe this if we join this two semi circular ring we will get one ring it is like this way okay so this two semi circular ring if we join we will get one ring okay so area of ring we know that area of outer circle minus area of inner circle okay so area of track is equal to two times area of rectangle so 2 into area of rectangle because two rectangles are there having same dimensions so 2 into area of rectangle plus one two semicircular rings are there okay so if we join these two semicircular rings because dimensions are same 
so if we join two semi circular ring we will get a ring okay so here i am writing area of ring okay so 2 into area of rectangle that is 120 into 14 plus area of ring that is pi into now here what is capital r so here i am writing r is equal to 35 is the inner radius plus width of the track is 14 so 35 plus 14 that is 5 plus 4 9 3 plus 1 4 49 meter that is capital r small r 35 meter okay so area of ring is pi into r square minus small r square okay so we have 2 into 14 28 into 120 plus 22 by 7 r square 49 square minus 35 square so 28 into 120 that is 0565 plus 5 33 plus 22 by 7 now this r square minus r square we can write 49 minus 35 And forty nine plus thirty five. Okay, so three three six zero plus twenty two by seven. Forty nine minus thirty five is fourteen. And forty nine plus thirty five nine plus five fourteen. Then four plus one five plus three eight. So seven two is a fourteen. So three three six zero plus twenty two two is a forty four into. 84. Okay, so if we multiply this 44 into 84, and if we add with 3360, 3360, then we will get area of this total track. Okay, understand this one?